Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to generate linearly separable data. So, first of all, what we are going to do, we are going to generate some synthetic data, and for that, I'm going to use NumPy library. So, np dot random dot rand. You need to specify how many number of uh, data points you want to generate. So, I want hundred and here you can specify number of columns so it will generate data in a form of xy so let me show you the value in x okay first we need to import and then so these are the data which actually generated and stored in X. Now what we are going to do if we will plot these data directly appear to dot plot X. So first we will take first column and then we will take second column. So as you can see, uh, in order to plot data points, instead of plot, we need to use scatter. So these are the data points we have generated. Now what we want, we will take some random line and we will color these data points accordingly. Like all the data points falling one side of line, we will color them with different color and the rest of the data points will be color with different color so let's say we are taking here a line 5y 3x minus 2 let's say this is the line so what we will do here we will uh, we will put value of x from our data point in this equation and uh, we will compute the value of y if our, if the value of y in data point is greater than this value then we will color them with different color and if less than then we will color them with different color so we will run a loop till the number of data point so here you can run a loop like for i in vain 100 or you can write in this way as well ok so now here I will write a condition if 3 x y 0 so the first column or zero column will represent x value minus 2 divided by 5 So this is the computed value of y and we will compare it with value of y available in the data point. So if this is the condition, we will plot them scatter 0 and here we will write i because we are plotting the current data point. one and here we specify color so here I'm taking red in else part I will assign a different color so G stands for green and finally I will all plt dot show so as you can see then this line actually going somewhere here so uh, let me change this line instead of 5 we will take let's say 4 and this one will take 6 now we need to take 
take some other line so let me take a simple one So here three X I zero just wait. Two and here let me take seven. So now it's uh, looking somewhat visible. So here this line is actually somewhere here. So uh, all the data points this side color green, this side red. So these data points you can use for your uh, exercise like for perceptron or linearly linear classifier. So in this way you can generate the data. Thank you very much for watching.